help you out with your problems. Um, where's the light? <laughs> Lights over there. There's a light on the desk. No, that's not the light. That's not the light. Here, I'll do this. There you go. Okay. Thanks, Elliot. By the way, this is stylistic suck um, for this video. So. Wait, have you started yet? Should Don't worry, Elmer. Advertisement by After Dark Medical. Welcome to After Dark Medical, your number one medical device company for after the nuclear apocalypse. When the power fails, we'll cure your ails. This is Jimmy. Unfortunately, Jimmy has some problems. He needs hearing aids, but how does he use them without power? The answer? He doesn't. Here at After Dark Medical, we've come up with a specialized hearing aid system that utilizes mechanical audio enhancement to help the hearing impaired. Customized to your specific head girth, we use high-end scrap metal from what used to be Google's headquarters to create a custom hearing aid experience just for you. Crazy, oh no! Jimmy has damage to his heart from all of the radiation poisoning. Suffering from bradycardia, Jimmy's heart beats dangerously slow and needs a pacemaker. But wait, isn't a pacemaker an implanted medical device that depends on electricity? Is poor Jimmy completely screwed? Not anymore! After Dark Medical has come up with a simple, no power solution for yours and Jimmy's pacemaker problems. It's our turn crank pacemaker. Just see any one of our many ADM vendors, and most of them won't have the medical know-how to shove it into your defective chest cavity and get this baby cranking. All you have to do is turn the handle for 15 minutes once an hour, and it winds the pacemaker up so that you don't have to worry whether or not your heart is going to beat for a whole 45 minutes. <laughs> our turn crank pacemaker also comes with the high speed function, so if you are being chased by raiders or cannibals, just crank that baby while you're running and your heart will be able to keep up with all of the physical activity. These medical systems may look like they cause more problems than they help, but it's yours and Jimmy's only option. So we're offering you these devices each for the low, low price of four gallons of water or three years of indentured servitude. The same, that medical is not responsible for defective devices. Infection after device installation. All the installation caused by fraudulent medical personnel. Death or injury caused by baby scavengers. Never injury occurring at the After Dark Medical Facility. Enslavement of all on-site visitors of the After Dark Medical Facility. <laughs> Thank you for watching this advertisement for After Dark Medical. Remember, when the power fails, we'll cure your ails. The preceding program was a paid advertisement <laughs> by After Dark Medical. <laughs> yeah. So can you, is there any kind of, you turn the light back on, is, is there any kind of a demonstration you want to give, or like how do they work, or? Can you hear me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, do you have a moment to crank your, uh, crank your pacemaker, your time? I feel better now. <laughs> So what is it like wearing those things? Very comfortable. <laughs> that's, uh, that's for happiness. <laughs> what it reminds me of is that scene in Jurassic Park where the guy slides off the road into the mud and then there's this little lizard that comes out. Yeah. And it's it's quite stylish, Jared. I don't. I mean, I think you guys should walk around during a Tuesday night. Yes. Uh, art series. They <laughs> just you slowly cranking it like, uh, I don't know what I do. like, fall down. like every time you want to move it forward, you just take another crank and take a couple steps and crank. What are the health centers? <laughs> <laughs> Can I get an upgrade? This is how you sell things door to door. Hey, I need surgery. <laughs> Oh, are you supposed so, to I mean, press stop? Can you hear? Can you hear better? I mean, I... yeah, definitely. <laughs> <Do you? laughs>
Was there like, is it, do you feel like this almost, did you hear like a funnel effect or a sort of tubular sort of sound? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> does it increase your, does it increase your desire to be chatty? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, does anyone have any questions or comments? I know, me too. I want to try it on. That's okay. <laughs> I don't think my head can see it. You also do three years in the dentist, right? Dude? <laughs> maybe maybe uh, afterwards we can, uh, on the break, we can have a, we can uh, try it on. Yeah, I want to try it. I like I don't know why, Mike, but that suits you so well. <laughs> I, 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 I feel like better. there's like this missing appendage that's like <laughs> trying to be found. Like, <laughs> does well with your hat and everything. Oh, cool. So, can you tell us a little bit about who did what and everything, and what, uh, what, how did you guys approach it? Well, uh, we worked together at the tech shop in San Jose. We met up and uh, we brainstormed ideas, uh, came up with the logo together. Uh, I don't know how he made that part. The connector and the loop. Yeah. yeah. And Is that made of cardboard or what's the material? Uh, foam cardboard. Okay. Um, it almost yeah. looks like it's really metal from here. Yeah. It looks like it's really copper. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's real metal. Okay. <laughs> Made from the foundation of Google's headquarters. Nice. Um, I drew. I uh, I used the bandsaw to cut and shape the whatever the, the pacemaker. Um, and sacrificed my belt. I also uh, did the video editing and uh, hired a paid actor for the recording. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. That's what I thought. Yeah, it's like professional talent. I think that's a motorcycle. Is that our we what? searched off of yeah, our motorcycle piece yeah. and then found a little. Is it, the, is it the crank start? Yeah. 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 Like a crank start? Nice. You know when you do the shift on a motorcycle? That's what we took. Oh, it's the shift. Uh, okay. Yeah. Not the start. The shock. The and and, and then we took yeah. a printer um, thing. We also it, printed it. it. The hole was really <coughs> square, so we drilled through that and then shoved the other part in there with a nut and a washer. And strap the belt to it. You put her belt on there. They're really, they're really nicely crafted. And the only thing I can say is you should, you should take some nice studio photos of them, like some nice high quality photos. You know, you, sh you should really, you know, do a photo shoot with them. Well, if you put this in the margin, you could really sell stuff. Would you like to buy one soon? I'm thinking there's about a hard, it. There's a hard hurt a lot. <laughs> yeah, four gallons of water or three years of. But you could think about stuff like where you did have a generator in there, and it, you, you created like you know like those little hand crank radio things they have to have it like strapped right on your chest like that, and then you know have lights go on or whatever it does vibrate or whatever vibrates your chest. So it's a massage or something. Um, Do we press the red button again? Do we press the red button again? Okay.